Vehicle and Firearm Updates. Today, we'll be looking at vehicles, new buildings, firearm attachments, and melee weapon setting updates. In this update, vehicles have undergone many improvements. First, we've enhanced vehicle stability and performance, the chance for four-wheeled vehicles to experience jerky movements while driving and parking has been reduced. Additionally, after catching some air, the landing process has become smoother to significantly reduce the likelihood of flipping over. We've also increased the Dacia, Coupe RB, and Murado's total fuel capacity, as well as the Murado's default health. Custom garages have been added to all maps. When you enter the garage, you can choose a vehicle to spawn. Do keep in mind that each garage can only spawn one vehicle. Garages on each map have their own list of available vehicles. Firearm Updates This update provides some nice improvements for players who enjoy combat. Some designated marksman rifles now support the full auto mod attachment. After equipping it, the firearm's rate of fire will be adjusted accordingly. In order to better adapt to the new attachment, you can practice in the training grounds. The supported firearms include the SKS, SLR, QBU, Mini-14, and MK-12. You can now choose which melee weapon to carry by default at the start of the match in the settings. Choose between the dagger and machete. At this point, you must be itching to play a match, so get on PUBG Mobile and give it a try now!